can use some of that late night energy again. So um, I'm still working. Um, I'm over out in my office in the other room working, waiting for my computer to do stuff. So I thought I'd share this, this wonderful, fantastic <laughs> instrument. This is the most complicated guitar you will ever play. <laughs> um, I ordered this in from overseas. They make them over in China. Um, I'll, I'll make a video explaining that whole situation if you're interested in that, but I just wanted to share the instrument with you. I thought it's quite fun, um, and I just haven't had a whole lot of time outside of work, really, um, to really spend much time with it and learn it. Um, I think it's quite great, uh, as it has your bass strings here, so say for example you play your C chord. find D on here. So there are um, your one, two, three, four, five, six bass strings, F, G, A, B, C, D, and this is one octave here. You can tune it however you'd like actually, but I've tuned it G to G. It's quite nice. It takes a significant amount of coordination. You can sort of strum the, um, the chord out and then and then pluck your melody there, but that, that just takes a, such a significant amount of muscle memory, um, even just visual identification when you're first learning how to do it. And I haven't had a whole lot of time to spend with this instrument. I think it's quite fantastic. I had to do a significant amount of work um, in terms of setup. Uh, because when I got it, all of the strings were just way too flimsy, poor quality strings, any of these things you get. But they didn't put real bass strings on here. They put, um, like, just a bunch of, um, I think they were all, like, guitar E strings. So it was very weak and rattly on the bass side. So that's taken a significant amount of work because these holes were not um, cut for bass strings. They were way too small. These pegs aren't even meant for bass strings, so I had to go in there with a drill do a significant amount of work and I actually had to reach my hand inside and feed my bass strings up in through there. My A rattles a bit, so I have to go, I have to need to remove everything and figure out I think the string isn't pulled up through enough. So anyway, I just wanted to share that a little bit with you. Um, it's just a neat, neat instrument. It's got a heck of a lot of um, sympathetic resonance, which is quite lovely when you play anything. It's really lovely for lead if you're in an environment where you can hear um, the more subtle aspects of the voice of the instrument. The other strings, you can hear them singing along as well. It's just so lovely. Um, so uh, I played this with my Irish club the other night and strummed along at the uh, pub. Um, so yeah. Um, come bring us some figgy pudding. Come bring us some figgy pudding. I don't know what's figgy pudding, so I'll just have a beer. What's figgy pudding? I don't know what's figgy pudding. I don't know what's figgy pudding. So I'll just have a beer. <laughs> anyway, uh, I hope that was interesting. I hope that was. I got to get back to work. Uh, my computer's waiting for me. So, um, take care, everyone. Be well. Be safe. And um, hope you're having a great holiday season. Come home again soon.